Good morning, dear brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawo. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in, in which, which you partake, partake of Christ, Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds, our minds are filled with his grace, and, and we receive the pledge of the glory which, which is, is to be ours. ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ, you gave, gave us the Eucharist as a memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour, Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace, your grace into our hearts, that, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips. And my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And let us meditate on the joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery is a visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery is the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. 
The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of a child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother, Mother of mercy. mercy. Hail, Hail our, our life, our sweetness, and our, our hope. hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, God, whose only begotten, begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant to beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted, entrusted our Savior to the care, to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee Prayer for the Golden Anniversary of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O oh God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O oh God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, 
we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to the holy preaching, in speaking only to and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share to all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today, we celebrate the memorial of Saint Irenaeus, Bishop and Martyr. Saint Irenaeus was born around the year 130. Educated at Smyrna, he became the disciple of Saint Polycarp, the bishop of that city. In the year 1707, he was ordained priest at Lyons in France, and shortly after, she was, he was made bishop of that city. He composed the works defending the Catholic faith against errors of the Gnostics, and it is said that he received the martyr's crown around the year 200. We, we will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my, my mouth, mouth shall, shall declare, declare your, your praise. praise. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Come, Come let, us let us worship Christ, the King, King of, of martyrs. martyrs. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God and we are his people, the flock his shepherds. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they have seen all of my works. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I soar in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Please be seated. I lift up my heart to you, O Lord, and you will hear my morning prayer. To my words give ear, O Lord, give heed to my groaning, attend to the sound of my cries, my King and my God. It is you whom I invoke, O Lord, in the morning you hear me, in the morning I offer you my prayer, watching and waiting. 
You are no God who loves evil. No sinner is, again, is your guest. The boastful shall not stand their ground before your face. You hate all who do evil. You destroy all who lie. The deceitful and bloodthirsty men the Lord detest. But I, through the greatness of your love, have access to your house. I bow down before your holy temple, filled with awe. Lead me, Lord, in your justice, because of those who lie in wait. May clear your way before me. No truth can be found in their mouths. Their heart is all mischief. Their throat is wide open grave. All honey their speech. All those you protect shall be glad and ring out their joy. You shelter them and they rejoice, those who love your name. It is you who bless the just man, Lord. You surround him with favors as with a shield. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We praise your glorious name, O Lord, our God. Blessed may you be, O Lord, God of Israel, our Father, from eternity to eternity. Yours, O Lord, are grandeur and power, majesty, splendor, and glory. For all in heaven and on earth is yours. Yours, O Lord, is the sovereignty. You are exalted as head over all. Riches and honor are from you, and you have dominion over all. In your hand are power and might, in yours to give grandeur and strength to all. Therefore, our God, we give you thanks, and we praise the majesty of your name. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Adore the Lord in his holy court. O oh, give the Lord, you sons of God, give the Lord glory and power, give the Lord the glory of his name, adore the Lord in his holy court. The Lord's voice resounding in the waters, the Lord in the immensity of waters, the voice of the Lord full of power, the voice of the Lord full of splendor. The Lord's voice shattering the cedars, the Lord shatters the cedars of Lebanon. He makes Lebanon leap like a calf and Syrian like a young wild ox. The Lord's voice flashes flames on fire. The Lord's voice shaking the wilderness. The Lord shakes the wilderness of Kadesh. The Lord's voice rending the oak tree and stripping the forest bare. The God of glory thunders. In his temple they all cry glory. The Lord sat enthroned over the flood. The Lord sits as king forever. The Lord will give strength to his people. The Lord will bless his people with peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who called the Bishop St. Irenaeus to confirm true doctrine and the peace of the Church, grant we pray through his intercession that being renewed in faith and charity, we may always be intent on fostering unity and concord. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of Genesis. Abraham and the men who had visited him by the terebinth of Mamre set out from there and looked down toward Sodom. Abraham was walking with them to see them on their way. The Lord reflected, Shall I hide from Abraham what I am about to do? Now that he is to become a great and populous nation, and all the nations of the earth are to find blessing in him, Indeed, I have singled him out, that he may direct his children and his household after him, to keep the way of the Lord by doing what is right and just, so that the Lord may carry into effect for Abraham the promises he made about him. Then the Lord said, The outcry against Sodom and Gomorrah is so great, and their sin is so grave, that I must go down and see whether or not their actions fully correspond to the cry against them that comes to me. 
I mean to find out. While the two men walked and farther towards Sodom, the Lord remained standing before Abraham. Then Abraham drew near nearer to him and said, Will you sweep away the innocent with guilty? Suppose there were fifty innocent people in the city. Would you wipe out the place rather than spare it for the sake of the fifty innocent people within it? Far be it from you to do such a thing. To make innocent die with the guilty, so that the innocent and the guilty would be treated alike. Should not the judge of all the world act with justice? The Lord replied, If I find fifty innocent people in the city of Sodom, I will spare the whole place for their sake. Abraham spoke up again, See how I am presuming to speak to my Lord, though I am but dust and ashes. What if there are five less than fifty innocent people? Will you destroy the whole city because of those five? He answered, I will not destroy it if I find forty-five there. But Abraham persisted, saying, What if only forty are found there? He replied, I will forbear doing it for the sake of forty. Then Abraham said, Let not my Lord grow impatient if I go on. What if only thirty are found there? He replied, I will forbear doing it if I can find but thirty there. Still Abraham went on, Since I have thus dared to speak to my Lord, what if there are no more than twenty? He answered, I will not destroy it for the sake of the twenty. But he still persisted, Please, let not my Lord grow angry if I speak up this last time. What if there are at least ten there? He replied, For the sake of those ten, I will not destroy it. The Lord departed as soon as he had finished speaking with Abraham, and Abraham returned home. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord is kind and merciful. The Lord is kind and merciful. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all my being, bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. The Lord is kind and merciful. He pardons all your iniquities. He heals all your ills. He redeems your life from destruction. He crowns you with kindness and compassion. The Lord is kind and merciful. Merciful and gracious is the Lord, slow to anger and abounding in kindness. He will not always chide, nor does he keep his wrath forever. The Lord is kind and merciful. Not according to our sins does he deal with us, nor does he requite us according to our crimes. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so surpassing in his kindness to our those who fear him. The Lord is kind and merciful. Please stand. If today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. When Jesus saw a crowd around him, he gave orders to cross to the other shore. A scribe approached and said to him, Teacher, I will follow you wherever you go. Jesus answered him, Foxes have dens and birds of the sky have nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to rest his head. Another of his disciples said to him, Lord, let me go first and bury my father. 
But Jesus answered him, Follow me, and let the dead bury their dead. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat and welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. Magandang umaga din sa lahat ng mga nakikinig sa radio at nanonood sa live streaming. Noong bata pa ako, natatandaan ko ang libangan ko sa loob ng bahay pag hindi naman ako madalas lumalabas. So ang libangan, libangan ko ay TV. Nanonood ng TV, cartoons. Pag tinawag ako ng nanay ko, hinding-hindi pwedeng sumagot ng wait lang, or mamaya na, or teka lang, or sandali lang. Kahit dagdagan mo pa ng po, hindi talaga pwede. Hindi mo dapat pinaghihintay ang nanay mo, kundi makakatikim ka. Ngayon, hindi lang bata, kahit magulang nagsasabi ng wait lang. Actually, hindi ba si Chris Aquino ang nagpauso ng expression na yan? Eh, di ba magulang din si Chris Aquino? Wait lang. Pero hindi na importante kung sino pa ang nagpauso niya. Ang mas importante, parang nasasanay na tayong magsabi ng wait lang. Sandali lang. Magsabi kayo ng totoo, hindi ba naririnig niyo sa mga anak niyo? At hindi lang minsan, madalas. Actually, magandang pagmas na nating mabuti ang ating mga sarili. Gaano kadalas tayo magsabi ng wait lang? Kahit sa ano pa mang para ng pananalita, pare-pareho din. Wait lang, just a minute, just a second, sandali lang, hold on, hang on, in a while. Pare-pareho din yan. Baka magulat na lang tayo ma-realize na mas madalas pa tayo kaysa sa mga bata na magsabi ng wait lang. Baka tayo mismo mga adults, nasanay na sa expression na ito. Wala namang problema kung pwede talaga maghintay. Actually, may apat na bagay na pwede nating pag-isipan. Una, <clears throat> sino ang tumatawag at pinaghihintay natin? Sino? Pangalawa, anong dahilan bakit tayo nagpapahintay? Anong pinagkakaabalahan natin? Bakit hindi tayo makasagot kaagad? Tatlo, alam ba natin kung saan tayo dadalhin ng tumatawag sa atin? At kung malaman natin, pangapat, handa ba tayo talaga na sumunod? Sino, sino ang madalas na pinaghihintay ng mga bata? Mga nakakatandang kapatid, magulang, teacher, homework, gawaing bahay. Bakit sila nagpapahintay? Dahil naglalaro ng computer games, Facebook, YouTube, Messenger, at ano pa mga iba pang forms ng social media. At kung may time, paminsan-minsan, nag-aaral. For your information lang, sabi ng isang vlogger, si Libby Ryan, yung mga 8 to 12 year olds average more than 4 hours a day. Mga bata na 8 to 12. 4 hours a day ang ginagamit sa computer or sa phone screens. Mga teenager, nandun sa kanilang mga screens or sa computer or sa laptop or sa i... i... ang tawag yan? Tablet. Uh, 7 hours. 7 hours. Not even including... Uh, homework or more important stuff. Seven hours. Kaya medyo siguro dapat alagaan natin din yung mga anak, yung mga mata ng anak natin kasi nakakasira sa mata yan. Nakakaaliw na pagbasa ng mga bata at ang sarili natin. Sa trabahong bahay o sa workplace, madalas natin sinasabing wait lang. Pero sa social media, gaano kadalas tayo sumagot ng I will follow, or I like, or friends tayo. Kiniklik pa nga natin ng notification bell. Sa gospel na binasa natin, si Jesus pinaghintay din ng disipulo niya. Maring makatuwiran naman ang dahilan niya dahil maglilibing siya ng kanyang amang namatay. Ganun pa man, sinabi pa rin niya sa Panginoon, wait lang. Yung scribe naman, isang taong templo, 
nagbitiw ng mabigat na salita, Teacher, I will follow you wherever you go. Maangas, I will follow you wherever you go. Nakakasindak, follow, wherever, kakabilib. Kaya sinindak din siya ni Jesus. Foxes of dens and birds of nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to rest his head. Hindi na natin alam kung sumunod pa nga bang eskriba o tuloy na siyang nasindak. Tayo, mag-reality check tayo. Tutuhanan lang sa ating mga sarili. Sino ba talaga ang sinusundan natin sa buhay? Sino ba talaga ang sinusundan natin sa buhay? Pangarap natin? Idol natin? Ang puso natin kaysa sa utak? Sino ba talaga? Kay Jesus, may balak ka bang sumunod? May balak ba tayong sumunod sa Panginoon? Alam ba natin talaga kung ano ang ibig sabihin para sa atin ng We will follow you, Lord. Kasi, pinangako na natin yan nung bininyagan tayo. At tuwing papasok tayo sa loob ng simbahan, tuwing magsisimba tayo, sinasabi natin yan, I will follow you, Lord. Tuwing we recognize ourselves as Christians and Catholics, sinasabi din natin yan, Lord, I will follow you. Sinusundan natin si Jesus sa kanyang pag-iisip dapat. Tinutularan natin dapat si Jesus sa kanyang pananalita. At sinusundan din natin dapat ang kanyang mga ginagawa. Susundan din kaya natin si Jesus hanggang sa krus. Handa ba tayong sumunod kay Kristo? Hindi pwede kay Jesus ang wait lang. Hindi pwedeng mamaya na, hindi pwedeng later na Lord. Handa ba tayong sumunod kay Kristo ngayon? Kung hindi pa tayo handa para sa Panginoon ngayon, ano kaya ang gagawin natin pagdating ng panahon na tayo naman ang mga ilangan? Tayo naman ang kumakantok, kumakatok sa pinto ng langit. Ano kaya? Paghingi natin ng tulong kay Jesus, paghingi natin ng papasukin tayo sa, sa kalangitan, sasagutin tayo, wait lang. Pag tumawag ang Diyos, walang ibang sagot. Walang ibang sagot siyang hinihintay at tatanggapin mula sa atin, kundi now na. Now na. Kaya natin? Handa na ba tayo? Let us all stand. We bring our needs before God our Father, whose Son has gone, as, has gone before us and has called us to follow Him. With confidence, we pray for the grace to accept that calling. After each petition, we say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. <laughs> that the church, that the leaders of the church, and all those engaged in preaching the Word of God may persevere in their commitment to follow Christ. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That our community may be renewed from day to day through the faith and the word of God, calling them to a better life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those of us who have lost hope because of our sins may realize that Christ, our leader, walks with us and carries our burden. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer that those who are weakened by sickness or infirmity may be assured of God's comfort through the care and support of their families. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those whom we promise to pray, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For the mastery of the order, and his assistance, and for our brothers and ministry at Santo Domingo and Our Lady of the Rosary, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That the dead who followed Jesus 
enter God's presence forever in heaven. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. God our Father, in our desire to follow in the footsteps of your Son, make us one in mind and heart, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. <clears throat> Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. <clears throat> may the sacrifice we offer you with joy on the heavenly birthday of St. Irenaeus bring you glory, O Lord, and instill in us a love of the truth so that we may keep the church's faith inviolate, and our unity secure, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For you are glorified when your saints are praised, their very sufferings are but wonders of your might. In your mercy you give ardor to their faith. To their endurance you give or grant firm resolve. And in their struggle the victory is yours, through Christ our Lord. Therefore, all creatures of heaven and earth sing a new song in adoration, and we with all the hosts of heaven, of angels, cry out and without end we acclaim. of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, he broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you.
In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that by taking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Socrates, our bishop, Fidelis, his auxiliary bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with St. Joseph, our most chaste spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with St. Irenaeus, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Stand. Let us pray now to our Father in heaven in the words that our Lord Himself has taught us. Our Father, who art, who art in, in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy, thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass, trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, temptation but deliver us from, from evil. evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. <coughs> Lamb of God, you, you take, take away the sins of the world, world. Have, have mercy on us. us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. This is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this banquet. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please stand. Irenaeus, true to his name, made peace the aim and object of his life, and he labored strenuously for the peace of a church. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel, for he has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Irenaeus, true to his name, made peace the aim and object of his life, and he labored strenuously for the peace of the Church. Let us pray. Through these sacred mysteries, we pray, O Lord, give us in your compassion an increase of that faith which brought glory to the bishop, St. Irenaeus, as he maintained it even until death. And may the same faith bring to us, who truly follow it, justification in your sight, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat sa pakikisa sa Santa Misa. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mass ascended, we go in the peace and the love of Christ. Thanks be to God. You now bless the sick and your religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Made heaven and earth. God, our almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary, may all these articles be blessed, and those who use them made holy, as they fulfill the will of God according to the example of the Blessed Mother, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.